Well, there are fresh warnings on the dangers of synthetic cannabis and other drugs, as authorities concede they're losing the fight for the fight to outlaw them. The state government is now spearheading a national push to get the products off the shelves. State and national bids to ban synthetic cannabis compounds such as chronic have failed to stem the flow. Well, and they're coming up with new designs for these uh, synthetic cannabis products more quickly than the jurisdictions can find ways of making them illegal. Making policing the product a tough ask. People develop a brand and it might not necessarily be just because of the law but certainly the compounds within will change. People have no idea what they're taking. It also means a product that's illegal one minute can be technically legal the next. With the evolving drug market we're seeing um, laws um, that need to evolve with that. The Attorney General agrees. I think we need to change the approach that we as lawmakers are using to actually deal with these problems. He convened a meeting yesterday of senior police, law officers and health authorities to try and find a way forward. Mr Rao says he'll put the issue firmly on the agenda of the next national meeting of attorneys general in August. To try and get a national approach on this because if each of the states are doing different things we're going to have uh, serious problems across the country. Law enforcement agencies won't know what they're doing. In the meantime, authorities can only warn common sense. We have absolutely no idea of what the long or short term consequences of use of these chemicals might be. Personally, I think people are crazy to take those drugs. Tom Richardson, Nine News.